I've been diving for 40 years and it's my first turtle. We do treat divers, about 40 divers a year, with gas bubble disease, which is some variant of what he has, where they go in the chamber and compress the bubble uh, in their bloodstream or other places. So this is not unheard of and has been reported in turtles, something very similar to this. So we're using protocol, Navy protocols that we would use for divers. There's certain accepted indications in humans. Uh, we use it for dive decompression sickness, carbon monoxide poisoning, uh, we use it for certain bad infections. We also use it for people who've had cancer treatment with radiation and help rebuild the tissue and diabetic wounds. For humans, we can do what we're doing here. We can have them on ventilators. Most people, including patients that are in the chamber today, they're sitting in there comfortably breathing oxygen at high pressure. We can do EKG monitoring, which we'll attempt to do here and see if we can do that. We'll be ventilating. We have a ventilator, but not for turtles, so we will be ventilating manually. The one thing that uh, Tucker does have that that's very similar is he's a diver uh, and like our divers are so he won't have problems with his ears but when humans go in they have to pop their ears he's used to diving our our patients are not used to diving and going under pressure um, and we just want to make sure he's breathing normally so we don't cause any trauma to the lungs and uh, they breathe very slowly so the airway will help that we're going to go to three we're going to go to 2.8 atmospheres or the equivalent of 60 feet underwater uh, no water, but it'll be air, so it's pressurized to 2.8 times the normal pressure. Mm -hmm. Breathing 100% oxygen, and then we'll have little breaks of air. Um, the to then we'll go down to 30 feet. It's called the U.S. Navy Table 5, and this is a, a, about a two and a half hour treatment table that we use for certain types of decompression sickness. Hopefully from a, from a from physiologic point of view from the hyperbaric chamber, we're going to compress bubbles by Boyle's Law, and I'll show you a little football that we'll put in. Okay and uh, we'll compress the bubbles, and, uh, uh, and, but we also breathe in high amounts of partial pressure of oxygen. It'll absorb bubbles that are not oxygen by just diffusion. And so we hope to shrink the bubbles wherever they are, and then Lasana can talk to help improve his buoyancy. We are the top you know, 24 hour level one accredited facility that can manage sick humans, uh, and so if we could reach out and provide that care uh, uh, to potentially help him, that would be uh, Good thing. It's new and exciting, um, and we're so appreciative that Virginia Mason is allowing us to do this, and um, we hope that it helps Tucker. We don't know for sure that it will, um, but we're, we're giving it our best chance.